right, welcome back to the Knives Fast channel, and this is what came in this week. There are seven new knives and two EDC items to check out. And guys, this is where you see real rapid first impressions. So here we go. You ready? All right. I'm, I'm ready. As ready as I can be. As slow as I am. The first one <laughs> is the new version of the Finch 1929. This is abalone, guys. These dropped yesterday. You're seeing this on Saturday. They dropped Friday. Traditional pocket knives. I will leave the link down below uh, to this guy. It's the same knife, same size, same everything, but what you have is abalone shell encased in acrylic. You can see through, kind of through there. Uh, very beautiful. The way it catches the light, you have the hand rub satin 154 cm blade. Uh, these are running 149. There's this, and there's also a staghorn version that dropped. So definitely check those out at TPK Traditional Pocket Knives.com. And thanks for Finch uh, sending that guy out. So the next one is the Aurora Rays from a new company. Don't even know a lot about them yet, other than they've been a um, OEM for 20 or 25 years. Um, this is gorgeous. This guy is in titanium and uh, M390, and these are running $266 on their website. We'll have a link below. This is absolutely incredibly done. It really is. Um, the only little nitpick I can come up with is I wish the blade came a little bit further out, but it doesn't really matter. What a beautiful hand rub satin blade. Gorgeous feel and, and, and gorgeous milling and a great, great ergonomic knife. This is really fantastic and quite the cutter as well. All right. And next we have two tenable knives. Uh, the first one is, <coughs> wow, uh, the tenable Nest Street, guys. This is the button lock budget version of the Nest Street. Um, this guy is $57.89. Again, this is the Nest Street. It is in 14C28. It is a, th um, a thumb stud operating knife with this green micarta. There are other versions. I will have a link from Blade HQ below. I love the Nest Street overall and the way it feels in the hand. It is a great blade uh, and a really nice cutter. Again, not bad. Good action um, indeed, especially for a button lock. I dig that one. And then right beside it, we're going to put uh, a version of one of my favorite <coughs> concept knives of the past year. This is the Doc Designed um, Prometheus. And this one is also in 14C. And this one is 5889. It's in OD Green Micarta, little green uh, pivot collar accent, same shaped clip, um, very cool flipper knife the detent on this one is staggeringly good i mean it is really really good and for 60 bucks um yeah i will endorse this all day long so there you go that one is available at uh blade hq as well next <clears throat> just came in the devo knives tall boy this is the the uh Shoot, Casey, the dark mode version from our friends at uh, Blade Binge Shop. Eric over there is such a cool dude. This is the Brittany Blue uh, Camo Carbon with the gorgeous um, S90V black wash blade with the thumb stud and the hole. Easily flickable and really well tuned as far as uh, the thumb studs. Great pocket clip. It is reversible. Kev's looking out for you lefties. Access to the lock bar is unbelievably good. You got this kind of sub frame lock here, uh, which is really cool. Um, I dig this one a lot. I mean, really do. It's it's good. Now, there's going to be a di bunch of different versions. Uh, the price, I believe, is $199, and there will be 10% off codes. Uh, I will share those probably next week or so because this drops on the 12th of September. Um, and this is the Blade Binge exclusive. I think I have one from Devo on the way. There's one at White Mountain. There's one at Traditional Pocket Knives. We'll talk through those 
soon, uh, but these are very nicely done. So that is five knives. So that means we got two to go and they are actually uh, brothers. So we have uh, two versions of the Tempest Knives designed concept. Um, wow, Casey, Thunderhead. This is my design for concept. Um, I'm, you know, again, this is a prototype. So we're looking for everybody's feedback. Uh, all the versions haven't really been determined yet. This is just to get a look at it. Um, love the ergonomics of this one. Thumb just locks in from back here. And if you want to come up here, you go right up here, kind of trigger this back and you have a great, great tall flat grind, uh, that works really nicely. You do have to get your finger off of the stinking uh, front flipper. I'm still getting used to that, but that's me. You guys will have no problems. Listen to that ting. Really cool. So that is the gray micarta and uh, weave carbon fiber version. And this is the blue titanium and gorgeous uh, black micarta version with the stonewash blade. Um, these are the two I have in to check out. I don't know the price yet. I don't know when they will drop yet. I do know it's a great knife so far. I'm enjoying it so much. Great cutter. So there are two versions of the Tempest Knives uh, Thunderhead. All right, and then I got two uh, EDC items in to check out. The first one is this gorgeous Through Night Catapult Mini Pro. Guys, this is ludicrous. <laughs> I don't know the price yet because I haven't gotten to look it up, but this, but I'll have a link down below. I th I'm guessing with through night, it's going to be less than 50 bucks. I don't know that for sure, uh, but I, I bet that's right. Uh, this thing is 2,800 lumens and it is a crazy thrower for such a small package. Look at that, um, that reflector in there. This thing is absolutely crazy. It is rechargeable. Um, we will have a full video on this as well. And then this is the Through Night pill holder, guys. Check this out. They sent this, and when they said they were going to send a pill holder, I'm like, well, how boring is that? But this is not. This is actually really cool. So why is this cool? Because they made it modular. So you can, whoops, you can actually take this apart in four pieces. And so what happens is, You've got all these different little canisters. So you can actually take this and you can pair it with the end cap and just have a small little pill holder here for a couple of things. And it comes with a chain to put around your neck or whatever. Or you can do two. Uh, so you could do a middle one and an end cap, or you can add another end cap, another middle one and another end cap. I think this is really cool. Uh, again, not sure of the price, but I will have a link down below. Um, and I believe it's aluminum. Again, I just got this in, uh, but I thought I would show it off. So that is uh, what came into the channel this week. Hope you guys have enjoyed that. Look, we are at uh, eight and a half minutes. Show me somebody who can give you all the information that quick, guys. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to ask below. There will be full reviews on each of these items. I'll probably do the flashlight and the pill holder together, uh, but everything else will be, you know, there'll be a video here, 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 and here, and um, uh, you will see that. Actually, on this guy, I may just kind of do a quick follow-up video, but we'll see. I don't know. Uh, but, guys, thank you so much for your incredible support. Uh, and I hope you enjoy these videos every Saturday. Uh, they're some of my favorites. And thank you so much for all you do. Give me a thumbs up, a comment, and a subscribe and notification. And thanks for watching the Knives Fast channel.